Welcome everybody. I've built a bot. So this is the edge bot and this one specifically, this variation is the EMA crossover. Now, most bots out there come pre-packaged, pre-optimized, and that's great. But sometimes you want to have a little bit of personal customization, especially if you are somebody that knows how to trade or maybe you don't want to customize it and you just want it done for you. Well, this does both. Now, the EMA crossover strategy that is in play here is quite unique in the sense that it is a crossover and the stop and target placements are based on a reversion strategy back towards a higher value or a higher period EMA, which I'll go over in a sec. Now, this one specifically is going to be optimized for gold, a uh, personal favorite of mine. And as you can see, these are some of the inputs that are on the initial uh, input configuration panel here on MetaTrader. So we have the ability to go in and change the risk percentage per trade. And just in the early stages at the moment, whilst the pip value is still being calculated, 10 as the value equates to 1%. We can set a risk to reward ratio and that will be dynamically calculated in a minute and I'll show you how. We have a minimum stop loss size which at the moment is 80 pips so that means that we're able to avoid getting caught in those really small moves where the criteria is met but probably shouldn't be taken because of how tight the, uh, the environment is. We have the fast EMA and the slow EMA, which is the uh, the crossover that we're looking for, where we have the 9 crossing the 21. And then we have the guiding EMA, which is the target projection, the reversion back to the guiding EMA. And we also have a session filter as well. So we sometimes don't want it to be trading certain sessions or maybe at the overlap of the new day versus the previous day uh, when spreads can get quite heightened. So we also have the ability to change that. Now, if I just open up the strategy tester, what I'm going to quickly run through is just a couple of the initial executions that it actually takes. So we have a dashboard over here on the on the panel, which would also be on the live environment that uh, just allows us to display some of the logs to give us a bit of an insight into what's happening. Now, just moving along quickly, what we can see is those two EMAs trailing up behind prices, the nine on the up, and the 21 and that slow lagging one down below here is the 200 so basically what we're doing is we're looking for the 9 to cross the 21 to then target the 200 now I'm gonna just quickly see when we get our trigger in a second just here bear with when we see that 9 over the 21 bank there we go so you can see here we got that 9 EMA crossing over the 21, the fast over the slow, and we're looking to target that guiding EMA, which is the 200. Now, the way in which this all works and the calculations that it's based on is that the algorithm will calculate the distance between the entry price of the trade and the guiding EMA, the 200 EMA, and then what it will do is it will calculate where the stop loss should go based on the risk to reward ratio that we put on the input panel. So in this case, it's a two to one. So if the distance between the open of the trade and the guiding EMA is 20 pips, then it will throw a 10 pip stop above the entry to give us that two to one risk to reward ratio. And then additionally, the lot size is calculated here, as you can see, 1.25 based on a 1% balance of the account. So we're in the position now and we're just going to slow it down because we're going to quickly see that the market does push away from the entry. And as you can see, we hit the one to one on the position. It was floating at 1% in profit or one R, one standard deviation away from the entry relative to the two to one risk to reward ratio. It moved the stops to break even, taking risk off the table, and now we are floating in profit with risk free. So one more thing I want to take to your attention is watch this stop loss down here. It's 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 updating on every tick. And the reason for that is because it allows us to get out at the specific price that we want to get out of. 
So we're just going to let this one go and see what happens. Doing its thing, almost taken out for break even, but we actually secured the, the win. So we got the 1.1, 1 .1, uh, the 1.87 on the reward. We are up in profit. We executed it showed us the stop size just for some debugging purposes but for now we're just going to watch this go through a few more trades and see what happens so we're just going to speed it up a bit we are pushing away from the ema we get the entry we move to break even prices moving around and takes us down to target bang now we're up 3.8 on the account so two wins back to back that is nice. This is just a back test. This is not uh, anything to take as gospel, but it's great opportunity to see the strategy in action. So bang, there we go. Two to one risk to reward ratio. And it is doing exactly what it needs to be doing. It's calculating the lot size. It's calculating where the stops and targets are. It's moving to break even like it just did there. And then it took us out for break even. So as you can see, we are back in another position and it is doing its thing. So this is the EMA crossover bot that uh, is, is still in development, but this is the first iteration that is now live. If you want to go and get a copy of it yourself to, to plug into your own MetaTrader 5 terminal, I'll leave a link below or above this video. You can go check it out. Uh, you'll receive all of the instructional videos to get it set up uh, from A to Z. Uh, it should only take you a few minutes, and if you have any problems, I'm here to help for any one-on-one -on -one support uh, and get you all set up. And once you have got the, the bot secured and you uh, got it all up and running, you'll also receive all of the ongoing updates for the future iterations of the, of the project. So um, you're always staying up to the latest features, uh, which gives you the ability to make more changes and tweaks where required or if you want to just keep it as a plug and play model and and let me do all of the testing and the optimizing then you'll always have the up-to-date parameters and inputs that have returned the greatest risk to reward and the greatest profits and the greatest performance that i believe to be uh, responsible and 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 sustainable going forward um, on, on maybe a, a quarterly basis, depending on the time frames, etc. This bot can also be plugged into any asset on any time frame, but I'm, uh, I'm specifically going to be doing it on gold. I'll probably drop it down off of the one hour a little bit lower. So the frequency of trades bumps up a little bit, but, um, we'll, uh, we'll do all of the testing and the optimization of it. And like I said, if you want to do that yourself, there'll also be the guides on how to backtest and optimize the bot leaning into the automation of MetaTrader 5 that is on offer. So with that being said, thank you very much for watching. I, uh, I hope to be trading alongside you in the near future. And let me know if you have any questions and we'll, uh, we'll speak soon. So take care.